Hey guys, welcome. This is George Master. Today, what I'm going to show you is how to put on a, an end cap on a hollow rope chain. Even anything that's hollow, actually, it doesn't have to be a rope chain. But in this particular uh, situation, you can see the chain is really, really hollow. It's not going to take much heat. So what I did is I rolled the piece. Okay, you could buy the end caps, I guess, but I want to make something very similar to this because it's it's a totally different end cap. These are cheapy right here. These are crap. But anyway, so I rolled the piece here. I shined one part of the actual stock piece, something I roll, and then I'm gonna cut it to size. And then we're gonna grind it down to whatever we need. But I wanna show you how we're gonna uh, do this, okay? So we're gonna just cut a piece, okay? Let's say just enough to to make these caps. So the reason I shine it on the inside because it'll be very hard to get at it later. So, but you want a nice clean job, even though when you heat it, it might tarnish a little bit, but if you dip it in alcohol and black acid, you should be okay. Okay, so what I do is I'm gonna bend it down just a little bit. So I'm gonna give it a nice shape here. Okay. So very simple, then we could grind it as needed. So I always leave an extra material so you could grind it as needed. So make sure you, yeah, get this here. Grind it flat on each end. You could round these off a little bit if you like. And honestly, it doesn't have to be exactly. I mean, you could grind it as needed, okay? You could do it here, you could do it on the chain, but since the chain is so thin, it's gonna be very difficult. So here's what I'm gonna do, the key to this is. So when you make the end cap, so we're gonna take the solder. Instead of putting the solder on the actual chain, we're gonna put on the actual end cap, okay? So. Make sure you flux this, okay? And we're gonna add the solder. It's gonna go, and be a little bit generous, but not too, too much. You don't want the solder going everywhere, okay? So I'm gonna do the solder on the inside. Okay, let it flow inside. And we're gonna go, here yeah, you can see I heat from the back, okay? So the solder sticks to it, all right? So I'm gonna flex it again. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring it to the actual chain. So this part here, you have two ways of doing this, okay? Always make sure there's not much there. So I wanna put a little bit of an alcohol burk acid. I'm not gonna dip the whole thing, just enough so it doesn't tarnish, okay? So we're gonna do it two different ways. I could go this way, stick it in there like this, and, and I would squeeze it as I, I heat it up like this. So I bring my flame, this part of the flame hits the whole piece. You don't wanna go directly to it like this because you will melt this so easily because it really does, it's like a hair, doesn't take much. Okay, so I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna heat it from the top and you know this is a really thick piece so I'm gonna heat it here in the front so it bends on me. See how I collapse it? And once it collapses there, I'm gonna go here, very gentle, and I'm gonna let the heat do itself, okay? So, I mean, uh, the flame do do the work for me. So even though it takes a little longer, keep an eye on it. As you squeeze it, let that solder flow in there. You can see it flowed on both ends. And this is it. Now the piece is on there. Okay, and this did not get melted. And always make sure you clean that because I didn't clean it, because I'm lazy, okay? So once you got this, now you could shape, you can see the end cap is nice and even. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna shape it on here. Shape it to whatever you want. Whether you want it, you know, straight, keep it straight. You wanna thin it down on the ends here to give it that pointy look. But don't go too much. I mean, it's a nice new end cap. Why, why file it down too much? So I left it a little thick just to to, so I have enough room to grind down, okay? And it's that simple, okay? That's it. And there's your end cap. So I'm just gonna solder this. It's gonna go on here. And you have a brand new end cap. I hope you like this. Thank you for watching.